Hi, I'm Steve Clark, and I'm with ProSpot International. We're here today at the training center at our headquarters in Carlsbad, California. We're going to be talking about the NP3 nitrogen plastic welder. Let's start by first hooking up the nitrogen gas. We're now going to put the hose on the regulator. Let's put the nitrogen hose on the barb fitting. We're going to go ahead and install the air fitting with Teflon tape. So you're going to want to open your nitrogen tank valve all the way and set your regulator to about 14 liters per minute. Now if you're working with a gauge that reads in PSI, you're going to want to set it to 60 PSI or greater. Let's connect the filtered compressed air. Make sure that it's no greater than 135 PSI. We're going to connect the input power. And now we're ready to turn on the NP3. Now let's take a look at the user interface. This is the home screen. The first line reads your air pressure. We're going to adjust it by unlocking the air pressure control and adjusting it up to 10 PSI. and then push in to lock it. The next line is your gas pressure. Now in order to adjust this properly, we're going to push and hold the trigger and then adjust the pressure to 2 PSI. Then once it's set, you can release the trigger. When the trigger is held, nitrogen gas flows out of the hot air welder. When you release the trigger, it switches back to compressed air. The compressed air is used to prevent the heating element from overheating. The nitrogen is used when performing the repair. This feature allows you to use nitrogen gas only when you're working on the repair, therefore prolonging the lifetime of your nitrogen tank. Next line is your air power. Right now it reads 200 watts. We're going to push the hot air control button and adjust it to 250 watts and then push the button to return to the home screen. The last line is iron power. Right now it's set to 40 watts. We're going to push the iron control button and adjust it to 60 watts. And then return to the home screen. To turn on the hot air welder, simply push and hold the hot air control button until the light illuminates green. To turn on the iron, simply push and hold the iron control button until the light next to it illuminates green. You're now set up and ready to start welding. So that's the ProSpot NP3 nitrogen plastic welder. If you have any comments or questions, please leave them in the comment section below. If you'd like to learn more about the NP3, please visit our website at ProSpot.com. You can find us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Links are in the description. Thanks for watching.